guess my story starts like so many others, with a girl. A girl who worked in a photography store in a quiet little corner of Toronto, Canada. <laughs> Julia. What are you doing, Harry? Are you meant to be playing with that camera? <laughs> the two of us grew up together, born the same month, lived on the same block. To her, we were best friends. To me, well, never mind. I know you have to test it, but does it always have to be on me? Well, you're not getting a serious photo out of me. I can assure you of that. I shall be silly until you put that camera away. How about now, Harry? How do I look? Right. I have to get back to work now. You should do the same. Morning, my good man. Morning, sir. How may I help? A portrait, perhaps, in that fine uniform? Name's Barrett. Major Barrett. I'm looking for a photographer. Well then, Major, you've come to the right place. Forgive me, but have we met before? Your face looks familiar. Boy, bring some wine for the Major. The good stuff. Upstairs. Who is this fine fellow then? Your son, I take it. Oh God, no. That's just Harry. Works for me. Utterly useless. Ah, uh, I've been in the papers a bit. Done the odd recruitment poster. Oh my. Welcome. How are things over in Europe, Major? As well as can be expected. We fight the good fight as best we can. Fine place you have here. Do you take commissions? Outside assignments? Ah, here we are. You took your time, boy. Useless. Poor lad. I'm sure he's trying his best. <laughs> here you are, Major. To your health. Why, thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Now, you said something about needing a photographer? Yes, yes. Who took these? They're exceptional. Just the kind of pictures I'd need in the fight against the Germans. Ah, oh, blödes Funkgerät. Kurt, du bist der Techniker. Reparier das Ding. Brennt immer um dieselbe Zeit durch. Schnell, die Berichte kommen gleich. Richtig gehört, Kurt? IA 125? In der Einheit ist auch dein Sohn Max, oder? Alles noch unbestätigt. Ist wahrscheinlich gar nichts, aber ich sag's den anderen. Dear Katrin, I've done something I know you will not agree with. It's about Max. It's about our son. I know now why his letters are not reaching you at the farm. Kurt, wir warten schon. Zieh den Hebel. Die Ehre gebührt dir. Falk hat 
dich gesucht. Er ist auf einer der oberen Plattformen. Danke, Kurt. Wunderschön, oder? Nur nicht den Mut verlieren. Viele von uns hier in der Fabrik haben Söhne in der Einheit. Sie haben sich alle zusammengemeldet, alle aus demselben Dorf. Wolf sagt, es ist noch nichts bestätigt. Ist bestimmt nur ein Missverständnis. Das würde ich gern glauben. Aber es war die Nummer ihrer Einheit. Und wir haben Krieg. Kurt, dein Sohn Max ist doch auch in der Einheit IR 125. Machst du dir keine Sorgen? Entspann dich. Ihr macht euch alle nur so viele Sorgen, weil die Heimat so weit weg ist. Kannst du den Direktor fragen, Kurt? Er weiß bestimmt etwas und er respektiert dich. So the pictures from Taylor's new camera were great. And Julia looked beautiful. But I'd never tell her that, of course. Don't know why, but I kept one of those photos. Still have it to this day. Come on, boy. Do your damn job. There's no rush. I'm sure the lad's trying his best. So make it a good one, boy. Major, would you also mind a picture with my daughter, Julia? Not at all. It would be my pleasure. Come here, girl. In you get. Make sure you frame them both in, Harry. Come on, girl. I don't bite. Tell me, Major, are you married? Father! Truth be told, I wish it was me in that photo. The way she was around Barrett. <laughs> I'd never seen her like that before. Julia was right. He was a hero. Der Direktor weiß bestimmt etwas. Wir müssen ihn fragen. IA 125? Die meisten Jungs von zu Hause sind in der Einheit. Bitte, Kurt, frag den Direktor. Du kennst ihn länger als wir alle. Er respektiert dich. I needed answers. We all did. So many of us at the factory have sons who went to war together. 
somewhere even in the same unit as Max. The chief had a direct line of communication to the front. If anyone knew the truth behind these rumors, it would be him. Ah, Sie kommen genau richtig. Es gibt Neuigkeiten. Einige Männer aus der IR 125 werden zwar vermisst, aber deswegen sind sie noch lange nicht tot. Wir wissen bestimmt bald mehr. Aber fürs Erste muss die Produktion weitergehen. Wir können ihnen jetzt nicht helfen. Wir können nur beten. The others may have been content to pray, to hope for the best. But I could not. What became of our son's unit? I had to know. So I have gone to the front, Katrin. I have gone to find Max. I'm impressed, Harry. You're a real professional with that camera. Listen, I'm heading back to France in a few days. You should join me. Help your country, take a few photos. Return home a hero. And remember, Harry, women love a man in uniform. And it was in that very moment I decided I was going to war. That night, I left and never looked back. Even though it would get her in trouble, Julia gave me Mr. Taylor's best camera. Truth be told, I didn't ever want to go to war. I only ever wanted that uniform. Maybe one day Julia would look at me the way she looked at Major Barrett. After that, it was all a bit of a blur. So much happened over that next month. They signed me up, put me on a train to the coast. They even gave me that uniform. You will think I'm impulsive. But to me, there, there was no choice. Our son is missing at war. I, I cannot deal with doubt. I will not live with uncertainty. This is my path now. And before I knew it, I was taking photos in the middle of the ocean. I'd never even left Canada, let alone been on a ship before. You could have fit Taylor's whole photography store in the front deck alone. I'd wake up early each morning to practice with my camera. We must have been close to shore that day. For the first time in weeks, I saw birds. The camera Julia gave me was marvelous, the best I'd ever used. I could even change the lens to see things close up.
photos on the boat were easy. I'd had more trouble with customers back home. Once we arrived, I didn't know what to expect. Everyone said the Germans were crazy. And so I'm on a train heading out of Germany, where I write to you now. It's not a comfortable journey, being on this train. For you, my darling, nothing changes. I will still be away from home. Only now, I will carry out my duties as an engineer on the front lines. I will enclose a letter to Lucy to tell her I, I have gone to find her brother. Um. Welcher Tag ist heute? Ach, sei still. In ein, zwei Monaten sind wir wieder zu Hause. Unwahrscheinlich. So wie es an der Front für uns gelaufen ist. Stimmt. Franzosen halten wir da. Wenn die Amerikaner einkreisen, oh, Amerika mischt sich nicht abgeschlossen. an. Wir sind auf der anderen Seite der Welt, wir sind denen egal. Der Kaiser weiß, was er tut. Wir müssen uns keine Sorgen machen. Wer ist da? Stehen bleiben! Das ist ein Munitionswagensoldat. Hier hast du nichts verloren. Wenn irgendetwas passiert, selbst die kleinste Erschütterung, weißt du, was diese Minen anrichten? Up early as usual, Harry. You're keen. I like that in my men. <laughs> Photographs of seagulls won't make the papers, son. Or are they for that girl back home? Trust me, she's not interested. But she will be, once you and I make those headlines together. Come on, let's get a few practice shots up at the bow. Get the flag in the photo, Harry. People love that kind of thing. You're the photographer, so how do I look best? Look at that seagull. I'd love my little boy back home to see that. Son, let's try some photographs, eh? Now, here's an idea. You, private, get over here on the double. That's it. Smile for the camera, my lad. Last one, Harry. Let's try one with the ocean in the background. Ich suche einen Platz, um nach Hause zu schreiben. Beim nächsten Wagen kann bestimmt jemand bei so etwas helfen. Und Vorsicht auf dem Weg nach draußen.
We need to let the captain know. Listen, ring the bell on the right if the ship should steer right. Or ring the bell on the left if the ship should steer left. Look lively, lad. I'll tell the captain. You keep your eyes on the sea. So, there I was, running left and right, ringing those bells like I was in church. I don't expect you to believe me, but I'm telling you that's what happened. To this day, I don't know why Barrett asked me to signal the captain. But for the first time in my life, I felt like I had purpose. Without a scratch. I knew you had it in you, lad. Keep it up, and that girl back home will be yours in no time. Ha! Now there's a photo for you, Harry. The King's Finest. Clearing the path to our victory. Nein, aber der hat vielleicht eine Stimme. Schön, dich kennenzulernen. Ich heiße Lothar. Ich bin Kurt. Eins nach dem anderen. Magst du Musik? Dann setz dich und wir spielen noch was. And so I've found somewhere to write. To focus on what I must tell our daughter. I will, of course, be careful of the words I use. She is still so young. Please tell Lucy. I hope she will understand. I hope you both will understand.
fortune smiles on me, Katrin. I've made new friends, Franz and Lothar. We play cards when we have the time and talk of home often. They're good men. I have arrived now, stationed at Vimy as an engineer. Engineers can use the radios, and I will listen for news of Max every single day. We spent weeks on that boat, and it was a few weeks more before we got to Vimy. I was so excited. Hell, I was like a kid at Christmas. And with the Major looking out for me, I wouldn't have to worry about the war. I'd only have to worry about taking photos. This is it, Harry. Vimy. Follow me, son. I passed through here on my way back to Canada. Hasn't changed a bit. Come, I'll show you where you can send letters home. Well, if it isn't Major Barrett, welcome back, sir. I saw you in the papers, sir, looking sharp as ever. You're too kind. Any correspondence from Canada? Just one for uh, Harry Lambert. You know him? That'll be from the pretty one back home, no doubt. Here, from a Julia Taylor. Dear Harry, I still can't believe you left. Our own Harry Lambert taking photographs of the Great War. It doesn't seem real somehow. My father knows his best camera is missing. He suspects you have it, but I told him it's not in your nature to steal. I won't tell if you won't. I know you're only there to take photographs, but I do worry about you, Harry. Stay close to Major Barrett. He seems like a good man who will surely keep you safe. Please write back as soon as you receive this. Send a picture if you can. Yours sincerely, Julia. Meet me by the three artillery cannons over there. Right. I'll show you the kind of photos we need. You gonna reply? Folk back home love receiving pictures. Photographer, could you take my photo? My family back home would love to receive a picture of me. You're the only photographer that is. Do you mind? Thank you. Here, I found this. It's not much, but you can have it. They say the war will be over soon. They've been saying that for years. You feel that, Harry? That rumble? That's the real war. Just a few miles away. So that big bastard right there is Vimy Ridge. I can't wait to get my hands dirty and take it back from the Bosch. This will be a great picture. Front page of the star. I can see it now.
There are people you meet who change your life forever. People who, whether they know it or not, plot your life on a different course from the moment that they say hello. For me, that was the major. I will always wonder what my life would have been like without him. Dear Catherine, my search for our son grows more hopeful by the day. Every day I ask the men if they have news, if somehow they have seen our boy. And today began just like any other. Wir sind beschäftigt, Kurt. Hast du nichts zu reparieren? Hallo Kurt, wie geht's? Das schon wieder? Ich hab doch gesagt, sieht aus wie eine Uniform der zweiten Division. Ich glaube nicht, dass sie in Gemie waren, Kurt. Tut mir leid. Das mal sagen würde, meine Frau fehlt mir wirklich. Mach dies, mach jenes. Die Offiziere machen nie die Drecksarbeit. Schon wieder. Ich kann dir nicht helfen. Da hörst du eher was über Funkcode. Hallo, Kurt. Ich habe einige Jungs aus dem Regiment getroffen. Es hieß, sie sollten zur Somme. Some think I'm, I'm mad to seek the same information from the same places, day after day. But persistence always pays off in the end. Katrin, for today I learned of his location. I know where Max is now. Recruitment always need good, patriotic pictures. We need more troops if we're going to win this thing. And they'll enlist because of your photos, son. Capture the imagination of your fellow countrymen. Stir the emotions. Hmm. Looks like there's prisoners being transferred through here. I should give them the once-over. Dismissed. I've got an idea. Follow me, it'll be fun. Right, this is it. Jump in. I'll take you around the camp. I'm sure you'll see plenty of things to photograph. I'm just Winder, by the way, but everyone here calls me Jazz. What's your name? I'm Harry. Pleased to meet you, Harry. Hey, do you like music? I have a guitar. Me and some of the others like to play. You should join us later. Do you play cards? There's always a game going on somewhere. Sorry, I'm distracting you. You need to take your photos. I just like to make people feel welcome. Here's my unit. Most of us are from a place called Amritsar. You should visit.
Welcome to this side of the line, Jerry. I'm Major Barrett, and I'm your new best friend. Pleased to meet you. This would make a good picture. Show everyone back home how hard we're working. Yes! I don't drink the wine, but it certainly keeps everyone else happy. Here's my unit. Most of us are from a place called Amritsar. You should visit. Shout and swear all you like. Your talk, your kind always does. This would make a good picture. Show everyone back home how hard we're working. Your photos will be famous. I know it. The Major had taken a chance. He could have had any photographer he wanted, but he chose me. And I was desperate not to disappoint him. Boys, listen. I really am trying to stay calm here. But you are not making this easy. Not easy at all. Oh, I need a drink. Someone keep an eye on them. We should get the prisoners a drink too. It's good karma. You know this word? Karma? It doesn't matter. You get water, I'll get food. Let's go. Concentrate on the little things. That's what will get you through. Must remember to write home today. Don't worry, she'll get your letter in a couple of weeks. Move along, friend. This train here had a happy little accident. <laughs> we were laughing for days. The officers didn't find it funny, though.
That's a hella, Tommy. Did he just threaten you, Harry? Hmm. We can't be having that now. Bring your camera. This may not be kind, but it is, alas, necessary. Now leave us be, Harry. And that's an order. Nice. Hey, Harry. I, I just heard my unit is heading to the front. Are you heading to the front too? <laughs> we'll have an adventure, you and I. Good. Gott sei Dank. Das Funkgerät ist wieder kaputt. Kannst du mal nachsehen? Ja? Da kann ich dir nicht helfen, Kurt. Am besten reparierst du das Funkgerät. Ich habe gehört, die Ersatzteile wären heute Morgen gekommen. Sieh doch mal nach. Danke, dass du den Munitionsaufzug repariert hast, Kurt. Ist so gut wie neu. Tut mir leid, Kurt. Ich weiß noch nichts Neues. Ich melde mich. Es ist nachts so kalt. Als ich das mal sagen würde, meine Frau fehlt mir wirklich. Mach dies, mach jenes. Die Offiziere machen nie die Drecksarbeit. Ein dummer Krieg. Ich frage mich, was wohl zu Hause los ist. Ich muss heute noch nach Hause schreiben. Hallo Kurt. Heute ist Nachschub gekommen. Hier. Irgendwas Neues über Max? Nein, danke. Ich 
Hier ist alles im Eimer. I listened to the radio for hours before I heard. Es wurden einige Gefallene des IR 125 geworfen. Sie sollen an der Somme beerdigt werden. The Somme. Katrin. Our boy is at the Somme. It's many miles from here, but I will ask for a transfer. I'm sure they will understand. The sun sets as I write this. It reminds me of home, of the life we once had. Every day I ask for a transfer to the Somme, to Max. Every day I'm told no. It does not work like that, Kurt, they say. I will ask again tomorrow. As the days turned into weeks, I ran out of things to photograph. I wanted to get closer to the action, to take pictures Julia would be proud of. <laughs> you might have knocked me down with a feather the day Barrett came to me and said, Harry, get your camera. We're going to the front. The front. What was life really like there? I'd photograph it all. So this is it, Harry. The front. All the comforts of home. Find yourself an empty dugout, then come meet me for a drink. You'll find one over there somewhere. Ask around. Have some fun. He told me to try and have fun. But there was nothing fun about Vimy. Pictures you'd see in the papers back home showed happy faces, clean uniforms. That's not what I saw. You knew. You look fresh. If you get lost, just follow the signs. Hey, new guy. If you ever need anything, you come see me. I'll trade anything. Come back once you've settled in. The men scratched and dug at lice in their uniforms, covered head to toe in mud. There were more rats than men, and the smell was like an overflowing toilet. This was a million miles away from the adventure I expected. And no free dugouts here, pal. Try closer to the front. They empty fast. Hey, Harry, right? Harry. Lambert, I've got a letter for you. Dear Harry, my first correspondence from the war. I'm delighted to hear from you, Harry, but I do wish you would use your photography talent in a slightly more positive manner. The picture of the bird is delightful, although I have seen a seagull before. You must have seen more exciting things on your travels. It's so difficult to understand what you're going through overseas. Please find a newspaper clipping enclosed. It has a photo taken by Major Martin Barrett. I didn't know he was a photographer too. He is such an impressive man, don't you agree? Sincerely yours, Julia. If you want to send a picture home to your girl, you just let me know.
You hear what Bulletproof Barrett? Survived a lot of battles, that man. You the new photographer? That job's cursed. Good luck, mate. Hey, a word of advice. Keep your head down. Fritz loves to snipe. Are you scared? I'm not. <laughs> Bloody war. <laughs> Thank God for the rum. <laughs> Victory is just around the corner. some food. This waiting around is killing me. I'm so hungry. Ah, oh, I'm on the night shift again tonight. I reckon the brass will send us over soon. Everyone's saying it. Uh, What's the to right home today? Nothing for you here. Run along back to- A few months, they said. What day is it? Heard we go over soon. You came here at the wrong time, my friend. Oh, you're Barrett's new photographer. If you're looking for the front, just follow the signs to hell. Hello. That's a new guy, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Harry! Oh, you're here! I haven't seen you in weeks. Let's go play cards and catch up. Come on. Pünktlich wie immer. Du löst heute Lothar ab. Er ist immer noch irgendwo da unten. I 
Ich habe gehört, Sie versetzen dich, Kurt. Vier Monate sind eine ganz schön lange Zeit. Hoffentlich leben wir dann noch. Dear Katrin, I was sent underground again today. To the tunnels where we listened to the enemy. Lothar's shift ended as mine began. Some men do not take to the darkness, but as you know, I have grown accustomed to it well. Max was scared of dark when he was young. Do you remember? Leave the lantern on, Papa, he would say. <laughs> it would burn until morning. Nimm dir eine Lampe. Ohne siehst du rein gar nichts. Everyone says we go over Monday, sir. Is that true? Oh, don't you boys worry about that. Just enjoy the whiskey. Tell the others there's more on the way. I'll see you gents later. <laughs> Don't drink it all at once, eh? Er bewegt sich. Folgen wir. Eine Versetzung wurde also bewilligt, Kurt. Ich bin echt neidisch. They granted my transfer request, Katrin. Perhaps they grew tired of my asking. It will not be until August. But they will send me to the Somme. To Max. Though I have grave news to share also. We've clearly got a leak in the chain of command. Now then. Hast du das gehört? Kurt, hast du das gehört? Where the hell do these rumors come from? Everyone's saying we attack on Monday. But sir, I thought we do attack on Monday, the 9th, right? Yes, but they weren't supposed to find out yet. I need a bloody drink. You've heard the rumors, right? We go over the top soon. So let me ask you a question. Would you rather lose the war and live, or win the war and die? I know my answer. I've had enough of all this. I want to go home. Come on, friend. It's only a rumor. People say these things all the time. Everyone's feeling so down about this rumor. Music always cheers people up, but my guitar broke last week. I've nearly fixed it. I just need something for the pegs. Have you ever seen Barrett's fancy steel flask? 
the one he drinks from. I think I could use that. Go and find him. He likes you. Maybe he'll just give it to you. My boy, you found a dugout, I trust. Let's get another picture for the papers back home, eh? Major Barrett plans the next brave offensive. Photo by Harry Lambert. <laughs> I should look professional. Let me put this flask down first. <laughs> right. Picture. And make sure you get Vimy Ridge in the background. Good. Now rest up, son. Relax while you can. Photographer. Sounds like easy work to me. Lucky sod. You got everything, Harry. Say, do you know how to play? Wir sollten zurück nach oben. Alles in Ordnung, Gord? Wie zum Teufel kommt die Katze hier rein? Fangen Sie, Gord! Wenn die zu viel Lärm macht, wissen die, wo wir sind. Verdammte Katze, komm hierher! Four days from the date of this letter, we will be attacked by the enemy. I've been blind, Katrin. I I've been a fool. I've never imagined I might die before I found Marx. Never stopped to consider I may not return home. Forgive me. I should have returned immediately, should have reported the news. But instead I remained in the darkness. I could hear the enemy above me. They were playing music, Katrin. It reminded me so much of home. I lost track of how long I listened for.
warst du denn kurz? Das hat ja ewig gedauert. Vier Tage bis zum Angriff. Das ist übel. Ja. Ich würde alles tun, um heimzukommen. Ich frage mich, ob meine Frau an mich denkt. Der Feind hat seine Augen überall. Ich weiß es. Kurt, komm hier rüber. Was hast du da unten gehört? Sag mir, wo die Ratten sich verstecken. Ein Offizier der Alliierten hat gesagt, sie greifen in vier Tagen an. Endlich eine Chance, Tommys abzuknallen. Sonst noch etwas? Hier in der Kantine habe ich nichts erfahren. Und wo gibt es was Interessantes? Hier habe ich die Musik gehört. Ah, sie tanzen auch noch. Unauffällig sieht anders aus. First time you see someone die, everything shuts down. You're left with thoughts that go round and round. Some men here relish the opportunity to kill. I do not. Who are we to say who lives and who dies? That is God's will, not ours. You start to make promises to yourself. Promises to do right. To live well. To be a better person. If I can survive this battle, I am one step closer to the sum. I will eventually get my transfer. I will finally be able to find our boy. Take a few photos. Return home a hero. That's what the Major promised. But he didn't say I'd be photographing the battles. He didn't say I could die. I'm getting old, Katrin. I'm not a soldier. So, I figured I'd just stick by him. Hell, what choice did I have? Ready, boys! Come on, Harry! Over here! Joe! Snow! 
Sniper! We need to move, Harry! Now! Verlieren. Ich weiß es. Gott, hol die Munition aus dem Aufzug! Gleich sind wir mir! Gott, hol die Munition aus dem Aufzug! Gleich sind wir mir! Komm sofort! Ab nach draußen mit dir, Kurt! Wir halten den Eingang! Und ich schau Gott! Los! Bastards! That's a sea gunner's mind! Smoke! That's our chance! Now, Harry! Stay here. We need to move. Get a grip, lad. Think of that girl back home. This is it! Forward! For the Empire! You read about it in books. The white light, surrounded by the dark. Was I dead? Worse, I was still at Vimy.
anything happen. I can't hear him. Shut it! Jerry's got ears like foxes. hell was going on that guy was the enemy he could have shot me but he didn't dear Catherine I have survived though it's a miracle I have done so I spared the life of the man who saved me the Lord works in mysterious ways. anderen Seite müsste sie aufgehen. Sie braucht geht nicht weiter. Oh, Mensch, abgeschlossen. Das gibt's nicht. Abgeschlossen. Von der anderen Seite müsste sie aufgehen. Sie bombardieren das Gebiet. Es ist viel zu gefährlich. Das gibt's nicht. Abgeschlossen. 
Von der anderen Seite müsste sie aufgehen. Los, komm, Beeilung. Hier lang. Hilf mir mal. Hey! Komm, hilf mir mal. Hey! Hey! Hier drüben, mach die Tür auf. Danke, mein Freund. Without the bird distracting the German, who knows what would have happened? I know this is going to sound silly, but I truly believe that bird saved my life. Poor thing got injured real bad. I figured I'd return the favor. And so we are trapped underground. He's a good man. He found a gravely injured bird, which he nurses back to health. It's futile, but I have not the heart to stop him. Danke. Vielen Dank. Du hast mir das Leben gerettet. Sorry, I don't understand. What's going on? Das hier sind deutsche Versorgungstunnel. Hier muss es irgendwo etwas zu essen geben. I'm sorry. I don't understand you. What the hell was I doing? He was a German. We were at war. Only somehow, we weren't enemies. We found food, but... Who can say where the next meal will come from? We explored a while longer in search of water. Komm, hilf mir mal. Danke für deine Hilfe. Mensch, hab 
abgeschlossen. Water! I, I found water! Can you help get the bucket upstairs? Understand? Bucket? We are stuck here, Katrin, and I do not know how long for. We found water, but it will not last forever. I'm... Harry. Harry. Oh, ich, ich verstehe dich nicht. Harry. Ah, Harry. Ich heiße Kurt. His name was Kurt. I don't know if he meant for me to keep the envelope, but I never gave it back. Oh, and I almost forgot the best bit. We found a cat. I swear to you, it's true. A real, live cat. Stuck there, just like we were. Though I never believed it would, the bird has made a full recovery. Unable to escape, it now flies from the boy to me and, and back again. It's quite remarkable. I've never seen anything like it. I think we all lost track of time down there. Days passed, maybe even weeks. Food is low, water almost gone. If this letter finds you, know that we tried. And please tell Lucy. Thank <laughs> you.
Hey, Kurt, I made a rat trap. Or at least I tried. If we can find a good place for it, we might have something to eat. If you'd told me that one day I'd be underground catching rats for food, hell, I'd have laughed you out of the room. But there we were, stuck and hungry. We'd got the idea from the cat, trapped down there with us. She seemed smart. I couldn't believe my eyes. There must have been enough food and water to survive for months. Some had been opened, some eaten by rats, but most was intact. Whatever else happened, we wouldn't starve. I couldn't believe it. We hit the jackpot. Every shelf and every crate was filled with food and drink. We could live like kings down here, survive for weeks, months even. All we'd have to do was eat and wait. It wasn't soon after that we heard it, digging. Someone was coming. It didn't matter who, German or allied. One of us would be the enemy. We had to escape, and fast. Kurt, hey, I found some keys. Wozu gehören die wohl? Sieh mal diese Schilder. Die Pioniere benutzen diese Tunnel. Dann muss es hier auch Sprengstoff geben. I saw daylight. I knew we had to get through that wall somehow.
Harry, komm, hilf mir mal. Gut gemacht, Harry. So kommen wir raus. The boy found explosives. He was a resourceful young man, much like Max. So we looked for the best place to use them. Time was running out. I never truly understood the German, but there was one phrase he kept repeating. I kept telling him, thank you, Hero. Danke, Hero. I wanted him to understand he saved my life. And I think I understood, but I was no hero. When that roof came down... If he had not pushed me out of the way... Hell, I tried to run, and he just kind of tripped into him. I do not think I would live to write this. Hell. If you wanted to see me as a hero, fine. Who was I to argue? It's strange to think we will never see each other again. Geh zurück. Ich lege den Sprengstoff. Wait. Let me get a picture first. A uh, photo? Photo? Schnell. Wir müssen weg. We escaped, Katrin. We survived. Kurt's plan worked. Blew a hole clean outside. I couldn't believe it. Me? I found my way back to the front. Turns out they thought I was dead. Told Barrett everything. Apart from the bit where I made friends with a German. He said I needed a break. Asked me if I'd ever seen the Eiffel Tower. Although I did not encourage her, the cat followed me back to the trenches. In August, they will send me to the Somme. All I have to do now is work and wait. I couldn't tell you why, but that bird seemed to want to stick around. So I took it upon myself to train her. Hell, maybe she'd even be useful. And sure enough, Barrett was true to his word. That August, he took me to Paris. J'ai reçu les effets personnels de Félix hier. Il est tombé durant la bataille de Vimy. Il était à Vimy Il a sûrement combattu aux côtés de mon oncle, Émile Chaillon, un vrai cœur vaillant. Désolé, no parler English. Come and play cards with us, Harry. That's an order! Get over here, Harry! 
<rire> Bring the bird if you must. Le petit Flanagan est de retour. Is that bird real? It's certainly well trained. Mais Simon, ce n'est pas Flanagan. No, no, uh, this, this is Harry. Harry Lambert. Ah, ah bah il lui ressemble. Nice to meet you, Harry. Flanagan was my photographer before you, Harry. You'd have liked him, I think. He was a good photographer. Ah. He was a good man. So what happened to young Flanagan then? Oh, uh, um... Ah! The song. He... Are you all right, Major? Perfectly fine, yes. Let's just finish the game, shall we? Du solltest dich entspannen, Soldat. Komm, trink ein mit uns. Die von der IR-125 waren vor ein paar Monaten hier. Jede Menge Verwundete. Das ist vielleicht ein Wetter, hä? Fast wieder heim. IR-125? Die Jungs habe ich nie getroffen. Tut mir leid, mein Freund. Eine Katze? Hier? Unglaublich. Tut mir leid, nie gesehen. Eins muss man den Franzosen lassen. Sie haben ein paar schöne Flüsse. Den kenne ich nicht. Tut mir leid. Noch nie gesehen. Tut mir leid. Ich hoffe, du findest ihn. Sieht wie ein guter Junge aus. Siegmund kann sich vielleicht an deinen Sohn erinnern. Er hat ein Register. Du findest ihn auf dem Friedhof. Wolf hat zu viel getrunken. Wenn das ein Offizier sieht, kriegen wir richtig Ärger. So viele Gesichter. Da verliert man irgendwann den Überblick. Ich kann dir leider nicht helfen. Waldner, stimmt's? Kurt Waldner. Ich habe einen Brief für Sie. Ich hoffe nur gute Nachrichten aus der Heimat. My dearest Kurt, I understand and support you in what you are doing. But I must tell you, Lucy is ill, Kurt. It is her chest. Dr. Siegfried visited yesterday to examine her and he seems concerned. I believe he suspects tuberculosis, though he will not say. It is difficult to find medicine in the village. Supplies are scarce. Please, try to come home. Your daughter needs you. I love you. Always. Katrin. Well, I don't seem to be winning much, do I? Come on, Harry. Follow me. <laughs> Francois, mon ami. Let us in, would you? Major Barrett, ça par exemple. How are you, sir? Alive and well, Francois. This is Harry. I'm showing him the wonders of Paris. You brought him uh, to the right place. Bienvenue, Harry. Apologies, Harry. We have a strict no pigeon policy here.
Major Barrette, it's been a while. Ah, mon cher Marie. Harry, this is Marie. She's an old friend. Excuse me, Major, I am not old. If you want anything, Harry, you just ask. Don't be shy now. Habitué. Leur spectacle va le détour, c'est certain. Here, Harry, this is a member's card. Feel free to visit the VIP lounge. I'm going to catch up with Marie. Hey, sweetheart. I hope you're enjoying the cabaret. You have a member's card, enjoy the lounge. Hello, young man. Make yourself comfortable. We'll be right with you. Imagine that. The VIP lounge of a club in Paris. It was a world away from being trapped underground with a German. I still wondered about Kurt. What was he doing right now? Wherever he was, I hoped he was happy. Hell, I just hoped he was alive. You should see the graves, Catherine. So many lives, so, so many hopeful young men, now covered in dirt. I, I had to know if Max was one of them. Die jüngsten Gräber sind hinten auf dem Friedhof.
Kannst du uns helfen? Wir brauchen mehr Kreuze. Die sind da vorne in dem Karren. Hier so zwischen den Toten ist ganz schön hart. Danke für deine Hilfe. Es sieht aus wie sein Vater. Ich erinnere mich an sein Regiment. Die armen Jungs. Sie kamen verwundet aus Peron hier an. <lacht> wie die Löwen haben sie gegen die Tommies gekämpft. Du kannst stolz auf deinen Sohn sein. Die meisten sind hier begraben. Komm mit. describe how it felt to search for his grave, how it felt to look for something I hoped I wouldn't see. Das sind die Gräber, die du suchst, mein Freund. I found the graves of Mac's unit. Most were buried and accounted for. Except one. An unmarked grave. A grave with no name. I could not leave the place without knowing the truth, Katrin. May God have mercy on my soul. I'd grown attached to that bird. Hell, she'd been with me for months. But to the folks at the cabaret, she was just a pest to be killed. Wherever she was, I just had to find her and make sure she was safe. Where are you going? You know, it's funny. At the time, I was so shocked I wasn't even sure it was him. But the only person who looks like Barrett is Barrett. And if I hadn't been at the window at that precise moment, well, maybe things would have been different. Who knows? Ah! 
Are you kidding me? found yourself in this position before but sometimes you just gotta go with your gut Super numéro que t'as là. Dancing with the pigeon. Mais comment tu peux faire ça, mais je suis brillant. But it was not Max. Katrin, he is still alive. I know it. Please tell Lucy. The cat is still with me. You will meet her one day. I promise. This is my confession, Katrin. I know it was wrong, but I will do anything to find our son. I must. I pray for Lucy's health, and I will return as soon as I can. My thoughts have become dark of late. The others treat me differently now. Perhaps they know what I did. I fear what will become of me if I stay here too long. I do not know where Max is. And I'm running out of places to look. Barrett was never the same after that day. I tried to talk to him. Tried to thank him for showing me Paris. But he wouldn't even look at me. So I kept my mouth shut over the next few weeks and kept taking photos. They put more and more of my pictures in the papers back home fully credited. I felt like a star. Blue 
conceals the wound. It is her chest. Dr. Siegfried visited yesterday, and he seems concerned. I believe he suspects tuberculosis. Every night I have the same dream, Catherine. It is so vivid. The cat finds our son's body in a field of flowers. I see it whenever I sleep. Last night, the dream was different. I saw a dead tree amongst the flowers. The same tree exists out on no man's land, here at the Somme. I ventured out onto no man's land, alone. The others would later call me crazy, but I didn't expect them to understand. Corpses on no man's land tell their own stories of battles won and lost. To begin with, I found only French soldiers. But there were German soldiers too, Katrin. It is not easy confronting these bodies of men who once lived. But I had to continue, had to persist. Show us the pigeon trick again, Harry. It's so good. You got quite the reputation. <laughs> Everyone wants to see the pigeon man. <laughs> Go pigeon! <laughs> Long car. Let me sleep. <laughs> Good one, Harry. <laughs> Send the pigeon to Raphael's face. Right, just please. I know you've got a pigeon, and I know it's very clever, but leave me alone. Go take some photos or something. <laughs> Seems that bird of yours is more useful than some of the men. J'aime cet endroit. C'est calme et paisible. 
C'est étrange de se dire que beaucoup de gens sont morts ici. T'as combattu ici, non Comment c'était Pour être honnête, j'ai du mal à croire que j'ai survécu. J'ai... J'ai perdu mon frère dans la Somme. Ouais, toutes mes condoléances. T'as entendu ça y a quelqu'un J'ai vu du mouvement. Was it madness to head on to no man's land? Perhaps. At the time, I thought only of my dream, only of the dead tree. I found three bodies from Alpiusbach, boys from home. I'm so sorry. The first was Karl Günther. Please give his family my condolences. Betty's son was there also. I know she will be devastated. Oh, c'est beau ici. Et qui a pu planter ces fleurs Avec tous ces cadavres, elles poussent facilement. Ouais, ces pauvres garçons. Ils nourrissent les plantes. Ouais, je suppose qu'on finira tous par nourrir les plantes. The last was Jonas, you know, Dr. Siegfried's boy. He was a good friend to Max. Pas, pas de plus, Fritz. Arrête-toi, ou je tire. Attends une seconde. Je pense qu'il vient juste pour les morts. And though Max was not there, these boys were all someone's son. All these boys deserved a proper burial. I became consumed by the task. It takes its toll on a man, the constant presence of death. Harry Lambert, you say? You got a letter from Julia Taylor. Sound familiar? All good news, I hope. Dear Harry, it is simply not the same here without you. I have no one to talk to. And if I didn't know him better, I would say that even father misses you. Thank you for your photograph, Harry. It is wonderful to see so many different kinds of people all working together for the greater good. It warms my heart. They say back home that the war will be over soon. You shall be home before you know it. I do enjoy receiving your pictures. Please send another when you get a chance. Sincerely yours, Julia. Hey, Harry! Barrett was looking for you. We're all dead. All of us. You get over that!
Hey, Harry! Over here! You need Barrett's permission to come in here. And he's not a happy man. Nothing left for you today. Sorry. Do you really think my men have time for your stupid little tricks? Make yourself useful and fetch my documents. I don't care how you do it, boy. Just get my documents. Looking back, I don't know what I was thinking sending the bird. I guess I wanted to put a smile on the Major's face. To take things back to the way they were before Paris. Instead, with his plans flying out over no man's land, all I got was silence.
all sound strange, but a bird found me in the depth of my despair. It carried intelligence from the enemy, pulled me from my madness. I had to act. Saved by a bird, Katrin. And there was only one person who could have sent it. Then the Major turned, closest thing to the devil I'd ever seen. Do you realize what you've done? He roared, inches from my face. Do you have any idea what was on those papers? I told my superiors I found the plans in no man's land. I could not decipher the information they contained, but I hear we are to be moved to Pasindale. I don't expect you to believe this, but not only did that bird fly back to me, it brought a message with it. Danke, hero. Could it be possible that this bird of mine somehow found the German? I have arrived at Pasindale. Every man now carries a gas mask. Some question why the officers even expect a gas attack. But I know. How much had the young Canadian suffered to give me this information? Truth be told, most of war is just kind of waiting around for something to happen. And I waited at Passchendaele for months before something finally did. Hell, I survived Vimy. If I got lucky, maybe I'd survive Passchendaele. Hey, Harry! Barrett was looking for you. Move along, friend. Ah, there you are. Good of you to join us, Lambert. Get up there, boy. Take photos. What are you, a coward? Climb that ladder. No one wanted to go over the top. Not a single one of us. Hell, I just did what we all did. I followed orders. For my country. For the greater good. For Julia. Another massacre begun. Once more, we traded blood for yards gained. And amongst it all, the cat was nowhere to be found. It may seem like madness, but I promised Lucy she would meet the cat one day. I promised. Both sides fought to control a church, 
the largest landmark on the battlefield. If only we could cut off that communication! If you want to find Barrett, head to the cemetery! I have found your cat away, Laufen Sen. Geht es dir gut? Irgendwas hat hier wohl Angst gemacht. Die Rand in Richtung Kirche. Wir warten bloß darauf, uns da draußen zu erledigen. Deine Katze ist irgendwo da vorne, Kuh. Sie hat Angst, aber sie lebt noch. Verstecken sich in den Ruinen. Diese Kirche gehört uns. Ich glaube, da hinten war was. Da, da hinten. Ich suche mir einen besseren Platz zum Schießen.
I guess we thought we could gas him out. But the Germans held steady. I'd let the Major down recently. I wanted to prove myself. To make it up to him. Only, I didn't know how. She was safe. Thank God. I later wondered if she led me to that place on purpose. As if she knew something I did not. But I'm superstitious like that. Hey, Harry! Barrett's gone mad! He's gonna get himself killed! Fritz are holding us off from the tower. There's our goddamn artillery. I remember it clearly. I saw a side of Barrett that day I'd never seen before, and that I wouldn't soon forget. Every man Barrett's has his demons. Just yeah, like that. Talk to him. Okay. I want some more. I could do this all day, Fritz. The war took its toll on all of us. Even Barrett. Over here, Harry! Get a photo of this! Just for me, eh? I didn't see the shell. Didn't know what happened. But I knew I needed help. Harry, bist du das? Das ist unglaublich. What happened? Am I dead? Beweg dich nicht, verstanden? Ich helfe dir. Nicht bewegen. What are you doing? You're German. Sind wir erstmal sicher? Wie geht es dir? Bist du verletzt? Wow, how am I still alive? Hörst du? Da kommen Soldaten. Das klingt nach Deutschen. <lacht> Thank <laughs> you. 
Hast du hier Tommys gesehen, Kurt? Kannst du uns helfen, Kurt? Wir hören immer wieder Geräusche. Was machst du denn, Kurt? Ich heiße uns hinter der Kiste. Wenn du irgendwelche Tommys siehst, dann sag es uns. Ich glaube, da hinten war was. Da, da hinten. Hey, Kurt, heb meinen Balken hoch. Ich muss da durch. Photographer. Understand? Hey. Photographer. Hey, hey, Freunde, lasst ihn. Seht ihr nicht? Er hat doch keine Waffe. Lasst ihn. I tried to save him. He tried to save me. But I failed. Man, wake up. Come with me. We don't got much time. You transfer out tomorrow, right? Well, this is your last chance to get your camera back. Come on. A prisoner of war. A phrase I'd never have understood back home in Canada. But there I was, four months into a stretch, at the pleasure of the German army. I was to be transferred out to the country. 
I'll never forget that last day. They'd taken my notebook, my camera. This was my last chance to get them back. Come on, Harry. So, on cleaning duty this morning, I went through all their cupboards. I got your camera, your notebook, and anything else with your name on. I stashed it all together. It's ready to go. Listen, I'm on a break, but they got me cleaning the guard block again. You know what that means? Today's the day, Birdman. Shift starts again soon, and there's only one guard right now. Come on. Come on, Harry. Come on, Harry. Okay, Birdman, time to do your thing. Wait until I'm inside. You distract the Fritz, and I'll get your stuff. I'll meet you out back. I've already stashed your things. I just need a distraction, like we discussed, right? Come on, Julia. Blöde Gefangene. Jemand sollte sie alle erschießen. Alle. Psst, come here. Hurry, quick. Here's your stuff. Go hide it in your bunk before anyone sees. I had to hide them. A stack of letters. Months worth. The guards have been holding all of our mail. Now you'd think, that many letters from Julia, I'd have torn them open. But if I got caught, I'd never get out. I had to hide them. It was torture. Du, Gefangener! Weg von dem Zaun oder ich schieße! I'd also forgotten that Kurt had given me his address, back in Vimy. He lived on a farm, and I was due to be transferred out to the country. It gave me an idea, and I knew just the man who could help. Yes. Dear Katrin, Four months of asking and still they do not grant my leave. All that is left is my duty now. I wake some mornings forgetting why I came here in the first place. The only thing that keeps me going, the only light I see are these letters home to you and our darling daughter. The weather here has turned a lot colder. 
I ride surrounded by snow. Please tell Lucy. So I had Kurt's address, and was to be transferred to the country the next day. If anyone knew how to change a movement order, it would be my friend Julian. Change the address on your movement orders? Impossible. You're crazy. You can try, but it's your funeral, Birdman. Follow me. Right in the cabinet at the back, but that's the officer's quarters. You're not getting in there without a damn good distraction. Soccer. I hadn't played since I was at school. I hated sports. I was never any good at them, but for my plan, I didn't need to be. Wow, no more football for us. Our ball's stuck on the roof. I sat watching them in the officers' quarters last night. Damned Fritz. They were stuffing their faces, laughing. Well, no more football for us. Our ball's stuck in the roof. You're on your own, Hat Birdman. Good luck. Just leave me alone. Nichts dabei für dich heute, Harry. Wie immer. Tut mir leid. Wie lange bist du jetzt schon hier? Und nicht ein Brief. Ich fürchte, die Frauen zu Hause... Das Leben geht weiter, verstehst du? Die Reihe einhalten! Could be worse. At least the weather is nice enough. And I'd rather be here than in the trenches. What's the point? Weitergehen. Du hast hier nichts verloren. Kein Zutritt. Da kannst du nicht rein. Raus hier. Wir verhungern hier noch. Und erfrieren. Die Gefangenen jammern ja auch ständig. I've heard stories. Hey. Prison is dying out in the country. Schlimmer. Be careful. Da wird langsam alles knapp. You transfer out soon, Harry. You worried about where you'll end up? I 
I had a dream last night. I don't want to get transferred to the country. I've heard stories. So damn hungry. You want to play? Come on. Okay, wait until I'm ready, and then shoot. <laughs> One lucky kick was all I needed, and I got it. That ball was my way in. Jeden Tag immer das Gleiche. Verfluchter Krieg. I was on the train before I had the chance to finally read Julia's letters. I was so distracted. I didn't even care if I was going to Kurt's farm or not. My heart was pounding. Dear Harry, thank you for all the wonderful photos you send to me. I received no reply from my last letter. Please write back. My dearest Harry, I will not believe harm has come to you. I cannot bear the thought of a world without you in it. I love you, Julia. And for the first time, those letters carried the scent of her sweet, Sweet perfume. I had to get home. It had been nearly a year since I had seen my home, since I had seen my family. I could not sleep. At home, I dreamt of war. At war, I dreamt of home. I wasn't going home. Not yet, anyway. But I did have my camera back. 
To most on the Allied side, Germany was a machine, efficient and relentless. But there were people starving on that train, people that needed help. Ich habe solchen Hunger. Hast du diesen Wagen nichts verloren gefangen? Raus hier! Geh weg! Was ist? I remember a carriage of wounded German soldiers. Some gestured to me for food. I wasn't the hero Julia thought I was. I couldn't help these people, but I could take photos. One day, I thought, when I'm back in Canada, I'll show people what happened. Was glotzt du so? Geh weg! Lass ich mich nicht fotografieren. You know, they let the prisoners walk around. As long as we don't cause trouble. <laughs> and as I took those photos, I wondered, had my plan to get to Kurt's farm even worked? I had ten days at home and barely knew where to begin. I knew only that Luzi needed me. Myself to enter my son's room. Darf ich etwas Brot haben, Papa? Wo ist mein Bruder, Papa? Hast du ihn gefunden? Mama sagt, du erzählst nicht gerne vom Krieg. Warum, Papa? Mama sagt, wir haben nichts zu essen, weil Krieg ist. Warum braucht der Krieg das ganze Essen, Papa? Lotti dir im Krieg geholfen, Papa? Ist Lotti eine deutsche Katze, Papa? Was hat sie in Frankreich gemacht? Meinst du, ich kann auch mal in den Krieg, Papa? Wie du? Ich hab solchen Hunger, Papa. Wenn wir den Krieg gewinnen, gibt es dann wieder Essen? Was hältst du von dem Namen Lotti, Papa? Passt er zu ihr? Ich will kein Messer, Papa! Warst du immer noch an der Flugmaschine? Ich möchte eine große Scheibe, Papa. Es tut mir leid, Liebes. Dieses Stück Brot muss lange reichen. 
können wir Lotti für immer behalten? Mama hat gesagt, du hättest im Schlaf geschrien. Ist alles in Ordnung? Danke, Papa. Du hast mir gefehlt. Guten Morgen, Kurt. Ich habe Dr. Siegfrieds Stethoskop aus dem Dorf mitgebracht. Für Luzi. Luzi, hast du dein Brot gegessen? Wir brauchen Feuerholz, Kurt. Wir brauchen frisches Wasser aus dem Brunnen, Kurt. Holst du bitte etwas? Things were different at home. Weird. We have all changed up here. Maybe it was Lucy's illness. Maybe it was the war. But I never mentioned Max, for I could not speak of my failure. I did what I could, but we remained hungry. I remember that little girl so clearly. She was alone, and she was hungry. I couldn't just leave her. Maybe the adults on board could spare a little food. Whoever that chocolate belonged to, they'd be happy to feed a starving child. Or that's what I told myself anyway. Schokolade? Hey, er hat Schokolade. Was? Danke. Ich habe aber nichts, was ich dir geben könnte. Was ist los? Schokolade. Schokolade. Was für ein Luxus. Danke. Vielen Dank. Oh, danke für die Schokolade. And for some reason, it reminded me of the man whose life I had man I accidentally said. sent Allied intelligence to. The German and his cat. Hey. 
Was machst du hier, Lotti? Hier, Kätzchen. Lotti. <lacht> Komm hierher. I did what I could, but Lucy remained ill. I wish I knew how to help my little girl. I came home to see my wife and my daughter, to spend time with my family, and yet none of us spoke. I thought I could come home from the war. I thought I could leave it behind. But I understand now, Katrin, and I'm sorry. I can never leave the war behind. The war follows me wherever I go. Sure enough, I found myself on Kurt's doorstep. I didn't know how he'd react. It's one thing being friends with the enemy in a tunnel underground, but another being friends out in the open. I needn't have worried, though. Kurt and his family were kind to me. They took me in, gave me a bed to sleep in, cooked me meals. In return, I helped out on the farm and did what I could around the house. A few days later, Kurt took me to a nearby village. There were things his family needed. Lucy, his daughter, was sick. And Germany was struggling to feed itself by that time. Everyone was hungry. So while I looked for food, Kurt looked for medicine for his little girl. Kurt trusted me with one of his ration tickets. People weren't too friendly. Nicht für dich. Geh weiter abschauen. Wir nehmen heute keine Patienten auf. Ah, was haben wir denn da? Das ist der Kriegsgefangene, der Kanadier. Ist er nicht ein hübsches Kerlchen? 
Sag sowas nicht, Edith. Das ist der Feind. Er ist ein Mörder. Ach, Mörder oder nicht, er ist ein sehr stattlicher junger Mann. Mehr sag ich ja nicht. This is German Ration Ticket, not yours. You bet ticket, then we play. Frieda, dein Englisch ist ausgezeichnet. If you win, you get food. If you lose, we get ticket. Come play. Good. Ticket on table. Nicht vergessen, Edith. So wie wir es geübt haben. <lacht> Trottel. Was? Hat er gerade gewonnen? gerade gewonnen? Na toll, er hat gewonnen. Reingefallen, Wanze. Wir haben gar kein Essen. <lacht> Was machst du hier? Raus hier! Da kommst du nicht rein. Und hier gibt's nichts für dich. I couldn't believe Kurt still had that cat. She was a funny little creature. You could often see her on the rooftops, chasing birds, I guess. Murder! Hau ab!
Wir nehmen heute keine Patienten auf. Hey Kurt, geht's dir gut? Du weißt doch, du kannst hier nicht rein. Kein Kämpfen mehr. Keine Waffen. Bitte, lieber Gott. Entschuldigung. Mama hat gesagt, kein Essen ohne Marke. Eine Essensmarke? Wir haben noch ein Leib. Nur für Sie. I finally found a loaf of bread. Food for Kurt's family. Hey. Ich halte es nicht mehr aus. Ich kann nicht mehr. Alles kommt wieder in Ordnung. Moment, ich komme schon. Ich, ich kann nicht glauben, dass von meinem Sohn heute in einer Woche ist sein Geburtstag. Er war kaum alt genug, um zu kämpfen. Moment, ich komme schon. Ich kann nicht glauben, dass von meinem Sohn nur noch eine Uniform bleibt. Was gefunden? Hey Kurt, schön dich zu sehen. Heute ist mein letzter Tag. Morgen muss ich zurück. Henriette hat mir von meinem Bruder erzählt. Unfassbar, dass er nicht mehr da ist. Jetzt mache ich mir nur noch Sorgen um meine Familie. Wir schaffen das doch, oder? Kurt, ich habe Klaus das von seinem Bruder erzählt. War das richtig? Jetzt ist er völlig verzweifelt. Gebrochen. Hätte ich nur nichts gesagt. Aber ich danke dir, Kurt, dass du uns die Wahrheit gesagt hast. Kurt, ich habe das von Dr. Siegfried Jung und Klaus Bruder gehört. So viel Leid, so wenig Freude. Wann ist das alles denn endlich vorbei? Hoffentlich bringst du mir eines Tages gute Neuigkeiten über meinen Gregor. Kurt, wie schön, dich wiederzusehen. Zumindest wurde Jonas anständig begraben. Dank dir, Kurt. Jonas hat uns vielleicht verlassen, aber deine Tochter ist noch bei uns. Diese Pflanze könnte helfen. Koch sie in Wasser und gib Blut, sie den Sud zu trinken. Entschuldige mich, Kurt. Ich möchte allein sein. Viel Glück, mein Freund. Now I could take care of Lucy. I could work on my plan for Harry. It was then Kurt showed me his plan. Seemed like he wanted to build a balloon. At the time, I had no idea why. A real hot air balloon. And he wanted my help. Come in, Harry. I sure hoped Kurt knew what he was doing. Hey, 
Hey, Fremder. Was soll das mit dem Vogel? Er kommt nie wieder. Er ist für immer fort. Du hast mir meinen Sohn geraubt, Mörder. Es gibt nichts, was du mir noch antun kannst. The inn opened its doors to the public. I knew Kurt was looking for a barrel. This was good timing. But would they let me in? I was the enemy after all. Vor dem Krieg konnte ich immer schlafen. Das ist vorbei. Was passiert, wenn wir einfach nicht zurückgehen? Ich lasse dich nicht gehen, Oskar. Hörst du? Du gehst nie wieder zurück. Immer mit der Ruhe, Mutter. Wir haben eine ganz schöne. Schön, Woche dich wiederzusehen, Kurt. Ich hoffe, Luzi geht's besser. Suchst. Suchst du immer noch deinen Sohn, Kurt? Der Krieg kennt kein Mitleid, Kurt. The innkeeper sure seemed good at talking, and Kurt gave him someone to talk to. The perfect distraction. Ich mag mir gar nicht vorstellen, wie das so ist, wenn man seine Kinder nicht beschützen kann. In Zeiten wie diesen bin ich froh, dass ich keine Familie habe. Meine Gäste sind mein Familie. Du bist wie mein Bruder, Kurt. Hast du das vom Roten Baron gehört, Kurt? Eine echte Tragödie. Das heißt, er hätte Hunderte abgeschossen. Die Tommies haben ihn angeblich mit militärischen Ehren bestattet. Remember, I had no idea what was going on. What use did Kurt have for a balloon? But whatever I said on the long walk home, Kurt's response was always the same. He pointed toward the sky. So that is what happened, Katrin. I took these things from the village. I made a plan to help the man who I believed to be a hero. To repay my debt for the time he saved my life. And for the time he sent Allied intelligence to help me. I wanted to build a balloon for him. I wanted to send him home. To set him free. as soon as look at me. And I guess that's because of the stories I was told, you know? To folks back home, he would have been an evil Hun. But he was also a father. He was also a husband. And he was also my friend. But I was too quick to trust the Canadian. Too quick to call him a friend. I see now how foolish I've been. I see now I was wrong. But Kurt wanted to build a balloon. And I think... He meant to build it for me.
Something was wrong. My daughter didn't normally call out like that. She didn't make a fuss. Maybe there'd been an accident and he needed my help. It never occurred to me that I'd done anything wrong. It just never occurred to me. That is er. That is er. That is my soul. And you have this Bild gemacht. Du warst dort. Is er tot? Murder! No! Oh! I was as surprised as Kurt. I didn't know who Max was. It's like the picture of his son triggered something in him. Flipped a switch. You could see it in his eyes. Before we knew it, he packed up early, went back to war, and took a bunch of my photos with him. Germany is interested only in its final push on the Western Front. They believe they can take Paris. <laughs> I've not come here for Paris. By chance, I've been reunited with Franz. I haven't seen him since Vimy. Franz is built for war. Cold and detached, he sees the Tommy as vermin. I never used to understand him, but I do now. He will be a valuable ally. He has agreed to help me find the man in the picture. So that was it. Kurt left. Me? I resolved to build that balloon. I didn't know if I could do it without Kurt, but I knew I had to try. It was a long shot. But I didn't want to spend the rest of my life in Germany. And back home, there was Julia. So I'd build that balloon. Truth be told, there was not much else I could do. I was always grateful to Katrine. Even after everything that happened, she let me stay in the house. <laughs> Maybe she just liked the company. I don't know. I helped in whatever way I could, and the three of us kind of fell into a routine. ein Feind, oder Harry? Du bist lustig, Harry. Du bist so albern und du bringst mich zum Lachen. Geh nicht weg, Harry. Bleib doch für immer in Deutschland. Eine 
große Scheibe, eine große Scheibe. Danke, Harry. That day, the postman gave me a letter. And for once, it wasn't from Julia. The postmark was from Newport, in Belgium. Ein Brief für Harry Lambert. Harry, my boy. It took me forever to track you down. I've thought of you often since Passchendaele. And I'm sorry, Harry. For everything. For dragging you into this war. For leaving you there. I swore to protect you and I failed. An officer is only as good as his men. And you are the finest of men, Harry. If you'll take one final order from your old Major, it's this. Go home, Harry. The first chance you get. Go home to your girl. You've got the uniform now. I know it's the only reason you joined. She'll love it. With respect and friendship. Barrett. We müssen über die Brücke, before sie gesprengt wird, Kurt! As we move against the Allies, as everyone focuses on the attack, I focus on one thing. I focus on the man in the picture. I will find him for you, Katrin. And I will find the truth. Kommt auf der anderen Frequenz noch mehr über die Alliierten. Last time I saw him was when the shell hit at Passchendaele. I couldn't believe he survived it. <laughs> I guess what they said in the trenches was true. The war just couldn't kill him. Work on the balloon was slow. <laughs> I had no idea what I was doing. Was von Papa gehört? Du und Papa bleibt für immer Freunde, das weiß ich. Ich will nicht, dass der Krieg aufhört, weil du dann nach Hause fährst. I barely even understood Kurt's plans, but he did, wherever he was. Dear Catherine, the offensive of Paris failed. We are forced to retreat to Germany. Yet today, I made progress for the first time. I know his name now. Du 
Du suchst nach den Kanadiern? Da hinten haben wir einen zurückgelassen. Die Tommys haben Scharfschützen in diesem Gebiet. Gehen wir nicht weiter. Every Canadian I capture either claims ignorance or simply misunderstands. They all look at me as, a, as if I'm some kind of madman. But this one understood. And this one recognized the man in the picture. to you. Is that Major Barrett? I don't know where he is, I swear. Barrett, Katrin. His name is Barrett. I daydreamed a lot back then. If I could finish that balloon, I thought, Maybe somehow I could escape. Maybe somehow I could get back to Julia. As the months went by, Katrine kept me updated about Kurt. She'd point to maps to show me where he was, explain as best she could. <sighs> Kurt sure didn't give up easy. Kurt! Das ist ihr Übersetzer! Was für ein Glück! Bring ihn zum Reden, Kurt! Der hier versteht jedes Wort. Was wollen Sie denn von mir? Bitte, ich habe einen Sohn. Ich habe das Foto noch nie gesehen. Das schwöre ich. Moment, das ist doch Major Barrett. Sind Sie hinter dem Herr? Er weiß etwas. Man sieht's an seinen Augen. Angeblickt ist er durchgedrecht. Er würde abgezogen. Droh ihm, Kurt. Er hat Angst. Er ist jetzt am Meer stationiert, in Newport. Mehr weiß ich nicht. He is in Newport, Katrin. And I will find him. I will find Barrett. It's only a matter of time. Katrin showed me the letter. Kurt's search for Barrett had led him to the Belgian coast. He'd found him. Whatever Kurt's plan was, it wasn't going to end well. And Katrine knew it. She begged me to save her husband. I didn't know if I could find Kurt. Hell, didn't know if I wanted to. But I did have the balloon. And one crazy idea. I suppose they will call me a deserter now. <laughs> but I never cared for this war anyway. I, I only ever cared for Max. Our son, my boy. Katrine gave me a map of Europe and Kurt's old hunting rifle. I don't know which one of us was more surprised that the balloon even floated. I flew all night in that balloon. Don't know how. 
But I got there. I was back at war. You can't see the war from the ground, because on the ground, you are the war. I'll never forget that moment, because in that moment, I truly understood what I'd been a part of. But I was tired, and I needed sleep. I barely knew which way was up anymore. What the hell was I even doing here? Maybe Kurt found Barrett days ago. Hell, maybe Kurt was already dead. I know you think I've changed. Perhaps you, perhaps you even think I'm mad. But I did what I had to do for our family, Katrin. And I found him. I found Major Barrett. Oi, what are you doing here, filthy Fritz? Nearly the armistice, anyhow. You lost, Fritz. You lost. Ah, Miller. More wine. I thought I was here to take photographs, sir. You are here to get me wine. That's an order. Yes, sir. How many, I wonder? How many lives lost under Major Barrett's command? They were just boys. Christ. They were just children. I sent better men than me to their deaths. I rob better men than me of their sons. But it's over. It's over. No more. Enough. Did I even want to save a man who didn't trust me? To him, I wasn't a friend. To him, I was the enemy now. A true friend would have heard me out. A true friend wouldn't have assumed the worst. I always thought if you cared about someone, that was unconditional, right? Photograph the armistice, he said. You'll be famous, he said. All I'm doing is fetching wine for an alcoholic. Photographer, that Harry. A good lad. I should never have brought him into all this. I hope you made it home to your girl, Harry. To your old life.
Fritz awakes, I see. I would apologize for knocking you out, Fritz, but... Well, I'm just not sorry. But I am curious about these little souvenirs of yours. So many German casualties must be quite painful to look at. That's what you get for starting a war, I suppose. It's over now, Fritz. <laughs> you lost. Du hast mir meinen Sohn genommen. Come on, Fritz. Give me something to work with here. What else have we got here? How did you get this picture? Are you a spy or something? Es interessiert mich ein Dreck, was du sagst. Genau wie deine Fotos. Einen Dreck. Was hast du mit meinem Sohn gemacht? You should try opening up more, Fritz. I sense a lot of pent-up aggression. <laughs> Let's try another. Hang on a second. These look an awful lot like pictures taken by a friend of mine. These are Harry Lambert's photos. What did you do to him? I'm listening, Fritz. Du... Du kennst ihn. Das Name ich nicht mehr ausspreche. Er widert mich an, genau wie du. Er hat gesehen, wie sie meinen Sohn gefangen hielten und nichts getan. Nichts! So, there I was. Right before the armistice. Mid-air, in a homemade balloon. I was free up there. Free to choose. Did I risk my life for a man who hated me? Or live the life I always imagined? Share my photos with the world? Go home. This is you in this picture. What the hell happened? Did you kill him? Is he dead? Answer me! If I found out you hurt Harry, you will beg me to kill you quickly. <laughs> ich bin nicht hier über ihn zu sprechen. Es ist mir egal, wie du mir egal bist. Ich bin deinetwegen hier. Ich will dich, Major Barrett. Oh, he knows my name. Ha <laughs> ha! This just keeps getting better. Ja, ich kenne deinen Namen. Und ich kenne diesen Harry. Ich kenne euch. Ist er dein Sklave, dein Lakai? Hilft er dir für Ruhm und Ehre, Unschuldige zu töten? Er ist doch schlimmer als du. Er ist ein Feigling. Ein Feigling mit einer Kamera, der glaubt, er wäre ein Held. You are the finest of men, Harry. I cannot bear the thought of a world without you. I love you, now and always. Go home, Harry. The first chance you get. Go home to your girl. Last picture, Fritz. So what about this one? Found this one in your inside pocket. What's so special about it, Fritz? Hang on a minute. That's me. Now you've really got my attention. And who's this young fellow I'm threatening? Finger, Finger weg von dem Bild. Finger weg, du Mörder! Du... Erinnerst du dich an ihn, Barrett? Weißt du überhaupt, wie er heißt? Sein Name ist Max Waldner und er ist ein guter Mann. Er hat an diesen Krieg geglaubt und er wollte die Welt verändern. Er ist mein Sohn. Mein Sohn. Und du hast ihn mir genommen. Wo ist er jetzt? Sag mir, was mit Max geschehen ist. Oder ich schwöre beim Allmächtigen, bei allem, was mir heilt. <lacht> oh, Fritz. I have no idea what you're saying. Noch keine Nachricht. Ich versuche mir keine Sorgen zu machen. Und sie brauchen mich. 
braucht ihren Vater. Sie muss wissen, dass er in Sicherheit ist. You should never have come here, Fritz. You see, to me, you're just one last little bit of war left to fight. We're moments away from peace, you and I. Funny, in a way. How about a photo? For posterity. You understand? I'll get the camera. Lose not. <laughs> that drunkard. I do not remember it clearly, but I escaped and I ran. I made up my mind. I had a friend, and he needed my help. I wanted to help Kurt, but for all I knew, he'd kill me. So I let the pigeon go. I wasn't far away now, and the bird had found Kurt before. I hoped she would again. But first, I had to land, and I hadn't thought that far ahead. I survived, and I thought I'd heard gunshots. I had no idea if Kurt was nearby. But if he'd found Barrett, he wouldn't be safe. I had to hurry. Barrett was determined and relentless. I knew he would not give up until he found me. For a fleeting moment, I almost respected him. Almost. I hadn't heard it for over a year, but I'd recognize that voice anywhere. At first, they were just two figures in the distance. But the closer I got, the clearer it all became. I think perhaps we got off on the wrong foot. It was Barrett, all right, and Kurt had found him. Hiding is not one of your strengths, I see. What was your plan, just out of interest? You come here, you find me. What then? You don't even speak English. What were you planning to do? <laughs> <laughs> Well, well, well. Harry? Harry Lambert? What the hell are you doing here? Harry. Kurt, I can explain everything. Harry? Was machst du denn hier? Huh? I came here to save him. I'm so sorry, sir. Ich will antworten, Barrett. Antworten! Was hast du mit meinem Sohn gemacht? Sprich! Was hast du mit ihm gemacht? Antworte mir! Jesus Christ, Harry! Who the hell are you fighting for? Please, sir, just tell us. Did you kill that prisoner back in Vimy? I don't know what he wants. He's crazy. Sag up! Bring it to me, Harry. No, he 
He's not crazy. He's a father. Oh, du erinnerst dich an ihn. Ja, du hast ihm meine Waffe an den Kopf gehalten. Wie ich dir jetzt meine Waffe an den Kopf halte, das war mein Sohn. Come on, Fritz. We've all lost someone we care about. It's war. Did you kill that prisoner back in Vimy? I don't remember, Harry. What's the German for probably? Ich muss wissen, was mit meinem Sohn passiert ist. Mit meinem Sohn. Mit Max. Hörst du? Max. Mein Sohn. Look behind you, Fritz. I've got far more guns than you have. Don't do this. Just get on your knees. I'm sure he'll calm down. I am your commanding Please, officer, Sir. Lambert. Point that gun somewhere else. Na los! Wenn du, wenn du schon hier bist, weil du alles bereust, Harry, dann töte ihn. Na komm schon! Sir, please, just call off the men and tell him what he wants to hear. Sein Name ist Max. Max Waldner. Hörst du? Max Waldner. Er war mein Junge. You think you're special just because you lost a son? The moment he pulls that trigger, your little friend here is dead. Er war mein Junge. No! So, that was it. I lost everything. They called me a traitor. A Fritz lover. A yellow. I still do. Don't weep for me, Catherine. <laughs> for I do not deserve your tears. I, I don't know how long I've left. I suspect only minutes. I I'm so sorry I couldn't bring our son home. Perhaps I go to him now. Perhaps. Barrett is dead. Yet I feel no peace. Have I been a fool, Catherine? Have I been blinded by my own rage? I have no answers. Only doubt. Word spread, even here back home. Taylor won't let me back in the store. Julia won't speak to me. If I have done wrong by you, Catherine, then I ask for forgiveness. Please tell Lucy. I should have shot him. Should have followed the Major's order. He was one crazy Fritz. <laughs>